Hi everybody, it's Tal here. I hope you guys are doing a great, having a great day. And let's get on with this. I'm going to explain building for companion spirit um, and the prosperity and the cultivation. I don't have as much resources right now because I used it all up before. So here we go. So once you get your companion spirit, um, I'm going to go with the hardest, uh, one of the hardest heroes, in my opinion, is Lotus Fairy, the build. So, what you're going to do is you're going to cultivate to, um, 900 for the tier 1, and then, um, and then tier 2, and then tier 3, and then you keep going forward with that. Um, and then you do the prospect. I don't know how to do, like, the prospect or the best way for the prospect, I'll, I'll admit that, but... As long as you don't, like, mess it up with, um, like, putting less than what you're just supposed to, then you should be alright. Uh, next up is the Echo. So, when you do the Echo for your Companion Spirit, you're going to have a certain set of skills that you want to use. So, we go to Decipher, and here we have the set of skills. So, since Lotus Fairy is a doctor, we're gonna have a doctor set and there's many different ones that you could use and there's many different ones that you can't use it's all it's all about building and from personally a lot of people like the bleed one which is the the vines one so the bleed one is pretty good and it's um, nice to have it does water damage and under the control of effect it does a bleeding effect and which is really nice so more HP the better uh, for the opponent for lose so we're going to skill exchange it and yeah we're going to oops, not skill exchange but decipher it we're going to decipher it again so now it's a level two and so you need one of rage and one of an active. So between the actives that I have currently is erosion and the bones. And uh, they're basically the same thing in my opinion. Um, but there is a little bit more damage and more for the, the, the turn. I'm going to choose the bone one just for now because I prefer the bone one. So now that we have it like this, you go and click equip and then follow and then equip and then follow All right so next up for the companion spirit is building the state well not the state but the, the spirit link so right now i have it set in a weaker version so i'm going to just reset it um let's see just the spirit link reset so here we go it's reset now it's i'm down a bit and I'm going to go to select spirit link and I'm going to craft. So if you are just starting out, you want to do fabled all by itself first so that you get the maximum amount of fabled first. And then after that, you do the quick craft again and do an epic in elite. After a while, it doesn't matter until you max it out. It's just that sometimes you don't have enough blade bamboo. And since if you don't have enough blade bamboo, you can't do all the crafting that you need with the fabled and the epics. So now, since Lotus Fairy is a unique type of hero where she is control and damage, you want to build her with all the stats possible and versus someone who's a guard who doesn't need it, who just needs like this. This is the guard setup. We don't need agility on it. Um, but, um, so you needs the agility or he needs the agility, or she needs the agility. So first we're going to start off by putting a max a fabled first, then the epics, and we're going to do the evasion, and then the epics, and the then um, this, and the epics as well. You're going to do the lower, lower types first, and then the higher ones after. You want to get as much of the low level ones before you put in the higher ones, because they take more space and that's because um these the, the companion spirits are a much weaker version than the actual spirits and next up is the attack so we want as much attack as possible 
And now, here is the tricky part. The tricky part for this is the defense and um, the HP. And since I only have 18 left, I'm going to split it into 9. So here's 9 for here, and then the rest is going into HP. There we go. So, this is the build for Lotus Fairy. She has everything, and yeah. I hope this helps you understand building. Um, obviously, I'm not going to explain every single stat, but if you want more of an explanation of single stats, let me know, and I will do my best to explain it for you. Have a good day.